Hi everybody, I'm Heather Wilson, and today I am so excited because I'm going to share, fix my hair first, because I'm going to share with you um, what I do with old nail polish. Because you know when you're at a party and people are like, oh, I just don't know if I could buy any jam berries because I have all this nail polish. What would I do with all this nail polish if I buy jam berries? And you're like, I will tell you what you can buy. First of all, went down to my Dollar Tree and bought me some special handy lashes. Right? You know what they remind me of? That guy with that really naughty song where um, he goes to the thrift store. I don't listen to that song because I read the lyrics. Naughty. I also did some sunglasses. These kind of match my particular style. Hello? Hi, everybody. Look at my nail polish glasses. Aren't they just cute as I can be? And then I have these. These are my reading glasses. Hello. My husband says I look like a librarian when I'm wearing these. Oh, you're just so funny, sir. Okay. <clears throat> Next, picture frames. This picture frame is not from the dollar store. This picture frame is from Ikea. We live right between two Ikeas. They're both about 450 miles from here. <laughs> True story. Um, my husband, the one who thinks I look like a librarian when I'm wearing these, bless his heart, when we go places, he lets me book hotels based on where Ikea is. Right? He says it's because he likes their Ziploc baggies. And we always need to stock up on Ziploc baggies. You know, for his lunch. I don't think that's why. I think it's because he loves me. Look, this is my frame. This is my little cam cam. It's kind of bright. Can you see this? Oh, wait, no? Hang on. I don't know. Anyway, so I spray painted this. Um, frame. That's a piece of jewelry from Walmart, by the way. How cool is that, right? So I spray painted this frame with some Tiffany Box Blue uh, spray paint, or for you who aren't so highfalutin, um, Robin's Egg Blue. Yeah. Or as my husband calls it, that other light, oh no, 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 that other baby blue. Bye Kim Kim. Oh, I forgot to show you the polish. I painted it with, and then can you see just this shiny part in here? I have this polish. It's actually a lacquer, it says. I don't think it's a lacquer. I bought it at a flea market. It wasn't used. It was new. I had like this whole rack. It's in South Carolina at the jockey lot. Okay, anyway, just have to trust me. It's got some, not glitter, but um, like an opalescent. Yeah. So in this... See this? It's a little wiener dog, and him got little yeggs. But one of him little yeggs broke off when we moved. One of her little legs broke off when we moved. Sorry, wiener dog. You know why I painted my wiener dog? I painted it first with a turquoise uh, polish, and then I put this glitter polish over it. Do you know why I did that? Because Hobby Lobby doesn't sell turquoise glitter wiener dogs. Hobby Lobby, right? They have like 347 aisles. How can they not have turquoise glitter wiener dogs? <sighs> Tell you what Hobby Lobby does have. They have little metal birds that you can put pictures on. This is my best friend, Kimberly. She died six years ago in a car wreck. It's really sucky. My mom hates it when I say the word suck. But she said that really sucked. So I can say that word. But this is our picture. Can you see it? That's from a long time ago. Anyway, so this bird has this little clip. You can put pictures on and it's got like this weighted stand or base. And I painted the little bird. It has stripes on it, but they were coral, and we don't have coral in any of our rooms. I do like coral. Not really salmon, but coral. Um, <laughs> okay, 
Oh, 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 more dollar store finds. Flip flops? Anybody? Flip flops? Ta da! Right? Right? Except, you know what? These are for people with real. Excuse me. I just had mix. No, Italian food. Mexico's on my mind because we're opening in Mexico. Yay! Um, anyway, so I painted these with some some coordinating polish that has glitter. And I actually have probably a dozen pair of flip-flops that I have painted with glitter on the top. And surprisingly, the glitter lasts. I don't know how. It, it cracks after a while, but usually that's, you know, they last until I trip on something and break the thing out that goes between my toe and then put a little thing from the bread bag in it to fix it and then it breaks again. That's how long that takes. So here's what I put my supplies in. My little ball mason jar. Ball perfect mason. I got this little lid right here. It got, don't got no, no, no little part in it that goes when you can things. I'm not a canner to my mom's chagrin. I eat canned food though, so if anybody wants to make me some and bring it on over, I would so appreciate it. So this is, um, I, I spray painted this brown because I have brown, well I don't in this house, we live in an A-frame now, and it's, it's cowboy. I've picked the decor in like all of our houses ever and so my husband got this turn anyway that's my little jar I keep my cotton balls in when I um, I actually have two when I go and I got this idea from Anna Hone from one of her um her video about vendor events so I take two of these to my parties and I put the clean cotton balls in one and then I put the dirty cotton balls in the other and you can paint them any color you want. I know my lighting is icky. I'm very sorry. This is my, okay, this is so funny. So we moved and look, look what's in here. <laughs> it's a, it's a ring bowl. I painted this with a regular um, polish. And then I don't know if you can see, I just barely did around the rim with some glitter and look what's in it. And there's another one. They're everywhere. Uh, you know, the uh, thing you put over the mattress, the mattress protector that's under your sheet. So it's like blankets, sheet, you, sheet, mattress protector. Underneath that, I found wraps. How, I don't know how they got there. I don't know. I don't know. Weird. Um, okay, so I love to glue things onto stuff. So this is a candlestick I got at Dollar Tree. And this is a little jar. It's vintage. And I found this plastic lid that fits on it. And I painted it my little blue. I have to repaint everything now because my husband wants turquoise and red cowboy colors. Don't know where those cowboys rodeo at, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. So look, this is what I keep my my Splenda and my Sweet and Low in. So look what it says. It says fake stuff. <laughs> so in the candlestick inside of here, I painted it and I painted under the base with polish. But this one, I love this. This is just a little bowl. Like um, I think it's like from a restaurant. And I painted glitter around the edge on the inside. I left it white. And then, um, oh, by the way, let me show you what I make these with. Have y'all seen two-part epoxy? They actually have two-part epoxy at the Dollar Tree. And um, I did a thing about this on my blog, and I compared epoxies. And the two-part epoxy works just as good as Gorilla Brand, which is what my son bought me at Walmarts. Down at the Walmarts. Anyway, so I use two-part epoxy around here. That's how I get them to stay. <clears throat> so, can you see this? Can you see how shiny that is? This is so cool. 
so this is just like a little Sunday dish and what I did was I took super glittery polish and I painted probably two layers around inside and then I put a coordinating color the same color but um, just a regular glossy nail polish um, behind it or like you know what I'm saying or in front of it um, the top layer so it made it more opaque but it's still super glittery mm -hmm. this is my Vanna something else these can you see them can you see them how cool is that oh oh no that was something else I already showed you <laughs> see those little things and I also do uh, bobby pins so that's it so you know what I do I don't really do well I have done a game with them and I've had people I like wear things you know I put on my glasses and I wear some flip flops and I have some of these in my hair. Sorry, my bra keeps falling down. It's just the straps, not the bra. So, um, and I have people point, you know, I say, so can you all see anything of my clothing or my accessories, what they have in common? And they figure out as people figure out what I'm wearing and what it is, I hand them tickets and then we have a drawing at the end of the night. But you don't have to do a game. You could just do it as one of those, um, I always forget the words. One of those things where, um, you know, you just make time go faster, but happy time passers. Anyway, whatever. You can just incorporate it into parties or you can just use nail polish that you might have not thrown out yet that you don't want to wear on your nails because it's not jamberry. <gasps> don't do that. Oh, we have excellent product. Use the excellent products. Anyway, that's all. Ooh, I thought I was going to break something. Bye, everybody. See you next time.